I do want to get into 50 Cent. So let's talk about it because I, we talked about this before on the channel and I told y'all that Daphne, I think it's her name, Daphne Joy is the baby mama. And I said, she needs to be careful because she knows 50 better than we know him. And from what we know of 50, he will sue your ass, right? And I said that and it was not much longer after. And now we're seeing these claims. He's already trying to get your son from you, bitch. So this is really messed up to me. In a sense, it is a bit messed up. So if she tries to counter sue him for defamation, because according to her, so this is where it started. Okay. And then we'll get into this. So, um, y'all know Lil Rod is of course suing Diddy for being violated while working with him amongst other things. Okay. He named, I believe her name is Daphne Joy, one of, um, 50 cents baby moms in the documentation and alleged that she, along with Miami and others were, um, SLs. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. Or did he say SW sex workers? Yeah, that's what SWs, right? So that's what he was saying. So 50 Cent likes to make a joke of everything when it comes to P. Diddy, okay? And you know what? Can I say this? And it might be some ins and outs as, um, it might be some ins and outs as I weed in the Drake with the 50 Cent and stuff like that and P. Diddy because I feel like P. Diddy isn't the only one that doesn't, I'm sorry, not P. Diddy, but 50 Cent isn't the only one that doesn't F with Diddy. And then it makes me look at now, and you see all the trouble that Diddy is in now, right? Now I look at Drake a bit and how it's so many people that don't fuck with him. And then now he got these allegations out on him, some light allegations, you know, uh, just because we've seen some things, don't we don't know what's really, really true or not. But it just makes me think like, Drake, baby, your time may calm down the road. You think that you were too rich for certain things to happen. And P. Diddy should definitely be an example that it doesn't matter how rich you are. OK, you could get tied the hell up. So I don't know. That just made me think of it. Like how many people don't really fuck with Drake? And I feel like there's a, a, a quite a bit of people that don't fuck with Diddy for real, for real either. So that's just interesting. Y'all might have some stuff. Like, I don't know, girl. Let me just keep going. So anywho. 50 Cent started mocking the SW situation with Daphne, okay? Um, Daphne got upset. She came to social media, and she pre – oh, yeah, her name right there in the, in the headline, Daphne Joy. So um, she came to social media and, and pretty much called him out and said that she's not a SW or anything like that, and then she accused him of violating her. I believe she said grape. I do believe that she said that. And I was like, whoa, I was like, if this is not true, ma'am, he is going to get you. And here we are. Here we are. They're saying 50 Cent files defamation lawsuit against ex Daphne Joy over R.A.P.E. and other claims. That is crazy. Whew, it ain't crazy. Not for real, because I mean, this is 50 Cent. All right. They're saying that 50 Cent is suing his ex-girlfriend, the mother of his son, Miss Daphne Joy, for defamation following her public accusation in March that he violated her while the two were in a relationship more than a decade ago. Daphne? <sighs> Shit. Daphne. Ooh, girl. It's. I don't know how to feel, right? Some part of me is like, I kind of hope that is, I don't want to put that on him if that's not true, but I'm like, damn, I hope for her sake that is true because I feel like you already ain't got no coin for real and he finna eat up whatever else you already got, you know? And I, I can't say that he shouldn't sue her considering the fact that it is damaging to his reputation if he is trying to build this G-Unit studios and all of that and ain't no telling what other partnerships he got. I feel like sometimes people can put allegations out there on people even if they're not true and then folks start to disassociate themselves um, with you and you could lose out on money like that. So, I mean, I understand it, him, like, suing her, but then I kind of wish that he didn't because that's your child's mom. Like, why do you get with these women, you get them pregnant, and then you hate them? It's like typical B-I-T-C-H-S-H-I, okay? It's, it's typical stuff like that. The only difference is you just got a whole lot of money with yours. Oh, thank you so much, Olga, for the super chat. Happy Thursday. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Um... So, yeah, I just, mm -mm, I don't think that's, that's your baby mama. You know what I'm saying? You're making it even worse than what it has to be. So I don't think that's right in my personal opinion. Um, they say the rapper, actor, producer filed the suit in Texas on May 6th after Navarez, or however you say her name, Dark, 
Narvez, I think that's it. Narvez posted a statement that he, her, um, on Instagram, she said this. Um, this is tough. And see, here's the other thing, y'all. As much as I'm getting on his case for suing the woman that put these allegations out there about him, if it did not happen, it is shame on her for saying such such a thing about her son's dad as well. So I don't think nobody's really right in this situation. Because why are you making a joke about the mama being an SW? And then when she turned around and say that you are her, I feel like that's not good either because y'all got a child and he's going to see this stuff between y'all. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, mm, that ain't a good look. But I mean, I do understand why he's doing it, though. But then it's also the petty part, too. Right. It's also the petty part. He could lose opportunity. But then it's also me being petty because I know you ain't got the money, bitch. A mess, okay? Um, what she said in that post was, I'm tired of upholding and protecting an image to our son that you have never even earned. Let's put the real focus on your true evil actions of arring me and physically abusing me, okay? Mm -hmm. And I believe that um, something did go down between them physically, I believe, um, to where I think he may have broke up some property and stuff in her house. So I don't know if he actually harmed her, but I do remember it was a situation where some items and things were broken. He was, he was being violent in my opinion in the house. So ain't broke up her stuff. So he was sued and he had to pay for the stuff that he told the hell up. So it seemed like this little back and forth, that guy has been very long standing. Um, and I don't know if it's a situation where she got with him to have a rich baby daddy. And he realized that she was only with him because he was going to be her rich baby daddy. And then now they can't stand each other because he figured out who she was. And she hate, he figured out, I'm not sure what the hate, why the hate is so thick all of a sudden. You know what I'm saying? Um, Jackson had previously denied any accusation of R and abuse towards his ex. Okay. He says, I'm deeply hurt by the lies in the Rodney Jones lawsuit. Um, oh, at least this is what she says. She denies the claims and she says she was hurt. Um, she says um, the claim that I am a SW is 100 percent false in character assassination. So I would have expected her to sue Lil Rodney. So why would you not sue him if he's putting that label out there on you? Instead, you put something out there on 50 and now it's backfiring and 50 over here suing you for defamation. Girl, this is some messy shit here it's really also given that miss jackson may not i mean not miss jackson but miss uh, narvis may not have no coin i feel like she might not have no coin to actually go up against and support um some of the claims that she's made and whatever's being put out there about her i just feel like she ain't got the money to take nobody to court right now mm -mm, girl this right here is messy i wonder how much he's suing her for though that's what i was trying to get to how much is he do they say This is crazy to me because what if she loses this damn case? It's like all the child support money he giving you, you finna turn around and have to give it back to him. And then once he bleeds you dry showing that you ain't really got no income and you can't afford to pay him, then he finna come in and swoop in and snatch up y'all child. Oh, girl. Mm, 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 mm. I hate to say this. I really do. I really hate to say this part, but um, good luck.